Hello everybody, Senor Filaramo here. I'm going to be giving you a brief tutorial on how to use voice recording with your Chromebook and then share it with me in Google Drive. This way I can give you points for your speaking skills in Spanish. So let's get right to it. First thing you're going to need to do is either hit the magnifying glass button on your keyboard or go to your apps and go right to store. This is your Google Chrome store. Okay. It's going to open online, so make sure you're connected to the internet. Make sure you have a signal going OK. And you're going to search the store for mic note and hit enter. And the first one that should show up is going to be mic note audio recorder and notepad. This is going to be a useful app for us during this class. If you don't have it already, hit the plus free button. It'll prompt you for permission and everything like that. So make sure you add it. Once it's added to your apps, you're in business. Okay, so once it's added to your apps, you should be able to find it in your apps by clicking the apps button down there and searching M-I-C-N-O-T-E. Okay, there it is. So just to check that it worked. All right, it loaded for me just fine. Make sure that you allow Google Drive and make sure that you're signed in using your students.roxbury.org account. Again, this is going to ask you for permissions, so make sure that you give those permissions when it asks you for them. Okay, you can minimize this now. And at this point, it's going to be time for us to find your speaking assignment. <clears throat> so if you could, Open up your Google Drive and click on the incoming button or shared with me. On the top of shared with me is the most recent documents that somebody has sent to your Google Drive. You should see in incoming or share with me a document that looks like the one I'm about to show you right in a second. It should look like this. It should say self intro dot mic note. And after self intro in parentheses, it should say your name. If you could check up here. So once you're in incoming, right, and you click on self intro, in incoming, you should be able to see what folder self intro is contained in. Once you know what folder it's in, you can go back to Mic Note, use your tools, Google Drive, and then you're going to be able to import the assignment I gave you right into Mic Note. Okay. shared with me and then it should be one of the first documents you see there can please ignore what i'm about to do on my screen on my screen i have to exit shared with me because i created the document so I actually in order to find this document i have to go somewhere else in my folders so let me do that i'm going to find the document All right, again, this is what it should look like. Self intro, mic note. Yours will have your name in it. As soon as I select it, I'm going to click import. It's going to load. And it's going to tell you whether it worked or not by saying imported self intro or whatever. Self intro and then your name successfully. And here is your assignment.
Record your answers in Spanish to the following questions. What's your name? How are you? Where are you from? What color is the flag of your country? And what's the weather like in January and in July in your country? So if I were to complete this, I would do the following. I would select start recording and then I would speak only in Spanish and give the answers to one question at a time. Start recording. Hola, me llamo Señor Filoramo. Yo estoy muy bien. Yo soy de los Estados Unidos. La bandera de los Estados Unidos es rojo, blanco y azul. En los Estados Unidos, en enero, hace mucho frío y nieva. Y en julio, hace mucho calor. Adiós. As soon as I finish, I'm going to click stop recording. I can check the quality of the recording by hitting play. Hola, me llamo Señor Filoramo. I like the volume, I like the clarity of the sound, so I'm ready to export this. All right, I'm going to export this to Google Drive. All I need to export is the mic note. I need to choose a folder. And the folder you need to find to export and send things to me is actually labeled Spanish. Okay, now depending on the class that you're in, your folder might be Spanish 7.1 as in mod 1 or Spanish 7.2 as in mod 2. Choose the folder appropriately. Select that folder. and export your work. If you want to double check whether it worked or not, even though it's telling me exported successfully, you're more than welcome to click Open Google Drive Web. Once you've done that, I should be able to see in Google Drive a new Shared With Me document from you, and in that mic note document, I should be able to hear your voice answering all these questions. I hope this helped. Good luck, and I'll see you in class. Adios.